Hi guys, how are you doing? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In case you are new here, Karibu Sana. Here we love having visitors. So guys, on today's video, I'm doing a um, TikTok challenge that I've seen going on. And the challenge is find vases in your house that are plastic or glass, but mostly it was that are plastic. And then turn them into textured vases. So guys, <laughs> I know this is silly, but I I have seen these um, challenges on TikTok, and guys, people are painting even um, water bottles, and guys, they were turning out so nice. So I thought, mm, why not try to do it? Because uh, right now, currently, I'm working on my son's bedroom. Um, I want to do a mini makeover in that bedroom, and I thought. Why not if I can be able to come up with vases that you know I can be able to use in the other room instead of buying new ones? Why not? So today I'm going to be doing that challenge, and apart from that, I also want to do like um coffee station, a DIY coffee station in my kitchen. But the thing is, I did not get uh, the things that I wanted to use in that coffee station, so let's just see where this will take us so guys this is what you'll need baking soda but i know this baking soda will not be enough so i will also be using this uh, baking powder this spoon is just for mixing purposes you will need a container to mix in your paint so this is the paint that, that i'm going to be using Bus value white it's not brilliant white but it's white paint i wish i had some other paint but this is what i have at home right now so this is what i'm going to be using that paint and of course your vases i have this this vase this is what i want to transform into like a ceramic um vase Actually, this was just um, a gift when I went to buy my four flowers. That lady who was selling gifted me this. So, of course, you will need a brush. I'm going to be using this brush. And then I have this old uh, wine bottle that I had spray painted into gold a while back, like years ago. It's still here. So, I also want. To use this in my bathroom so this is also what i'm going to transform into a ceramic vase i just wish i had a different paint color like earth brown yeah and then guys i've been seeing this trend on tiktok where people are transforming their plastic vases or plastic bottles into like ceramic um what is it called into like ceramic vases so this is the only plastic bottle i have at home i wish it was bigger but this is what i have this is just the normal water bottle and this if you remember when i was doing my living room what is it called yeah when i was doing my living room makeover i showed you guys this um vase guys this vase focus as you can see it has a bit of texture to it it looks as if it's ceramic but this vase guys was a plastic vase you can turn it around yeah this was a plastic vase that i turned into this cool like ceramic um kind of vase but in really it's just plastic i did some diy on this one yeah and this what came out of that so because i'm doing this inside i don't want to go outside because of the hassle of you know setting up and what have you so i'm going to be doing this in the living room on this table i'm just going to prep this table i'm going to cover it because i don't want paint on this i'm going to cover it and then start painting so let's get into this guys <music>
town From London to Taiwan I've been all around the globe Trying to protect your soul If I should stay or be alone Won't you make up your mind Cause I'm getting tired Of overthinking every move you make And I can help you decide Who you're loving now And how I'm not quite there somehow My intuition says to get So guys, this is the color that This is a very good just blue it's called Dutch blue so I'm thinking of using this on this butter or this I open this case and this looks like um they have written here that it's Tibet yellow but it's giving me like an orange feel so yesterday I was playing around with these two colors at night and I mixed this and this and it gave me a gorgeous gorgeous green. So I'm just wondering, should I go ahead and you know use uh, mix this and this, then apply on either of these and then I use this only here and then I use this again on one of these. I don't know or should I go ahead and change that color that this color there yeah that was my son he was watching cartoon earlier before he went to school in the morning I'm also thinking of changing that this color to something else I don't know guys and apart from that I have a, another project that I want to do so I have this huge tile here with me like that so this my caretaker gave me this I was looking for either a black one or a plain white one but this is what he had so my plan was to use it in my kitchen in my coffee area station but this thing is so big so I want to make it into a tray I have these two handles my plan is to do something like that but then I want to spray paint this to to I want to spray paint it to um, black color before I glue them on this thing I don't know does it look way better like this I think so when it becomes like that well guys what do you think like this tile is not my favorite color and as I'm looking at it right now it goes really well with these gold handles but the thing is these gold handles are chipping let me show you this here you can see it's chipping I just want to spray it to black so let me spray this to black and see if I do not like them I'll just spray paint them back to gold you go hate it when you see me with somebody living better I'm trying to tell you that me just do it me gonna have you jealous uh. I know that I gotta stay away from all your games yeah. I know that I find somebody else to love me with I'm done painting it and I'm not so sure how I'm feeling about it right now I don't know I don't love it and I don't hate it but it's I don't know why the camera is showing it it's yellow but actually it's a gorgeous like orangish color so let's see let me just give it time let it dry
Let me take you through what uh, is here so this is going to be my coffee station as guys you know my kitchen is pretty small so I don't want clutter on my countertops because the countertops are quite tiny so this is what's going to be my coffee station so at the back here I have my Sassini classic tea these are tea bags and then down there I have tea bags for gold tea they are still sassini and then in here I have uh, this is my sugar dish we have sugar there obviously in here we have my tea bags these are just the classic gold and I think I have some green tea in there as well and then I have my coffee here I have my chocolate here and then I just added a cup here and a spoon over here so that just in case someone wants to make tea or to make some coffee you just come in here you come over here I mean and you know do your thing so behind here guys this is one of the the bottles that I was DIYing earlier today so this is how it turned out guys it's really gorgeous and this is the only one that i really 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 love the other ones i did change color and we'll talk about them later so here i just have this um bottle then i just added this you know to give it to you break the white going on and then i have 
these what is it called this a palm branch yeah it's a dried palm branch so i just added in it there to you know give it some greenery over there so that's it let me know how did i do it's quite easy and this look at uh this tile tray that i made it came out really well i love it and then guys these things are quite very strong the handles these handles guys are very strong they're going to be here for uh they're going to last me for quite a long time and then over here over this thing i have um just decided to put here my this is my vinegar my cooking oil i have some toothpick in here some salt and then i decided to add here this hand sanitizer because you know we are always sanitizing our hands are always washing our hands so i wanted the sanitizer to be here so that anytime you need it it's very easy for you to reach it so that's it guys for this um mini coffee station ish i know it's not all that glamorous i don't have most of uh, my other coffees here but i think this is just okay or what do you guys think what do you guys think comment down below let me know how did i do so guys this is the final product these two are my favorites these two i'm not so sure about this green one like this color looked very pretty but when it dried i'm not feeling it anymore <laughs> I might just spray paint this to white even this I don't know what do you guys think like I love guys I love the texture on this it looks as if it's ceramic yeah it looks as if it's ceramic guys I'll this blue I'm not so sure about it but for sure this one I'm not feeling it guys I'm not feeling that one the green one I'm not feeling it at all but this one guys the blue one I love the texture on it love how it feels and remember this was just guys a wine bot a wine bottle yeah this was a wine bottle so I don't know if you guys can see it clearly but the texture on these things guys let me zoom in for you to see this texture yeah look at that texture guys it looks as if it's a uh, ceramic yeah there you go it's pretty it's really nice i wish you guys could feel this and this is my favorite <laughs> and guys remember this is a water bottle this challenge was really interesting so guys my plan was to use this in my son's room uh, my plan was to put some fairy lights in here i did order some fairy lights but they are not here yet but i have my christmas lights so let me put them in here and, and then we see how it will look but guys this is the finished look tell me which is your favorite among these like this one i'm going to use it in my kitchen these two i don't know they might just be zen's new toys Remember this was just a trial and then for this one this for sure I'm going to use it I love love the color on this and the texture guys it's the texture for me yeah so guys let me know down in the comment section which one do you love most would you try this challenge at home it's quite inexpensive because you are taking things that you already have at home the only thing i bought here was paint and the paint was going for like 150 kenyan shillings 
so it's in inexpensive but I love how they turned out guys I love 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 the texture on it I'm not crazy about the color like I do not like love it and I do not hate it I'm just in between there but for sure this color is my favorite followed by this one and then this blue one this green is the least favorite here but I'll spray paint it to maybe white and then I use it. I'm not so sure guys. I don't know. But that's it. So guys. I've put in here my Christmas lights. But for you to get the... What I was going for or to get the whole experience. Let me switch off this light. And then I also switch off the one for the camera. Yeah. That was what I was going for. Oh. You know, these are my Christmas lights. They are not that long. So my plan was to have some fairy lights in here. So when they get here, that's what I'm going to use in this um, bottle and see that guys so pretty so that's what I'll be using the, I'll be using the fairy lights in here of course there are so many of them I ordered two five meters five meters each so those are like ten meters so that's the whole look I know Zen will love 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 this one because I will be putting it on at night for him when he's sleeping so that there is some you know a little bit of light in his room but not too much light that he can wake up that's what I was actually going for and as you can see we achieved that look inside guys that's what it looks like inside yeah yeah guys that's it so you see now you get the idea of what i was going for but i know with the fairy lights it will look so cute yeah but what do you think guys is it an a or a yay <laughs> yeah but i love it especially if like you hang it like this you have those you know changing lights and what have you but I love it guys. I love the way um, it looks. This is giving me Christmas vibes. So guys, that's it from me today. Thank you so much for watching. Please do not go away without liking, leaving a comment and also share me out if you can. And I'll see you guys on Friday because this week we have two videos. Love and light. Bye.